You two, we are back on Free Code Camp doing JavaScript algorithms and data structures. We are in the regular expressions course on challenge 23 of 33. Only 10 more to go after this. So today, we're going to match a white space. So after the previous challenge where we had to restrict possible usernames, this is going to be an absolute breeze. That was a lot, a tough last one. So uh, once again, always guys, read through all this, understand what they're trying to tell you. Essentially what they're saying here is if you want to match a white space, the character class to do that is a backslash s, s for space, right? So you can see they have text, white space, space, white space, space everywhere. And then they say space regex is the, as we know, regex forward slash forward slash. Between that, we have the backslash s, and then we also have the g flag at the end. So they're grabbing all white spaces, not just the first one. So you can see with this match, naturally, we would get an array of the two white spaces right there, right there, right there. So that makes sense, simple enough. That's all we wanna do in this challenge. We're gonna change the regex to count white, uh, regex count white space to look for the, look for multiple white space characters in the string. So it needs to uh, look for multiple. So that's a little hint there using the G so we can grab all of them. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is straightforward enough, right? So we, we just learned that the backslash S is how we find spaces. So let's find a space. And now we want to find all spaces globally, so G. Now, if we run the test, that should do it. And once again, that makes sense because this finds the spaces. This tells it to find all of them, not the first one. And then we are saying result is assigned to be a method call. So uh, sample, so the string dot match, match is a method. So a method is a function, a function is equal to what it returns. So thusly result is equal to whatever this function returns, which as we know is in array because it's a match. So console.log result. As we can see, yes, result is the array that is returned from this match method because that's what it's assigned to be. So thusly, that's a correct answer. That's all we had to do for this one. So I hope that helped, hope that made sense. And I'll see you guys at the next challenge.